guest house. Two bedrooms over there. This is the master bedroom. Yes. Epic view. Crazy view. Well, that's amazing. Every house I do, it's about the quality and the integrity of the house. For instance, the tub is a one-of-a-kind tub that we made. What is that, walnut? Yep. I love walnut tubs. They hold heat so much longer than acrylic tubs. Out closet. I love a closet. These cabinets look custom. We make our own cabinets. It should feel like a high-end clothing store. This isn't just like walking to a house and going, wow, it's great. There's a lot of teak. It's beautiful. You have to understand the house. I think that's something that we have to really get into before we decide. I don't want to go down the same road. Did you see how nervous she just got when I said we're going to have to, like, review this? I'm not that nervous. OK, no? Let me assure you. OK, go ahead. <laughs> I'm good. I can see that he's testing me, but I'm not intimidated by him. I speak his language. This is a junior suite. Beautiful. All the lights are hand-blown glass from the Czech Republic. Media room, same view as the master. Yeah, that's incredible. There's roughly 8,500 square feet of deck. 8,500 uh, square feet? Roughly, yeah. Do you notice the screws? I do. See how they're all in line? Mm-hmm. How long did that take? Long time. <laughs> Is someone a little OCD? No. <laughs> Just went <it> straight. <laughs> You were up early this morning. I'm up early every morning. 5.45 is early on a weekend. Oh, man. Do you want me to rub your feet? Uh, yeah. Yeah? I didn't think you'd ever offer. Oh, oh, hold on, let me get all comfy. All right. They're a little sweaty. Yeah, they are. How was the uh, open house yesterday? That's why I couldn't sleep. What happened? I was so upset. What happened? Like, Frederick. Well, I didn't want to tell you last night because I didn't want to upset you, but, you know, I went, and as soon as I walked in, he saw me and just came for me. I, um, called, left messages, and so what? You know, just... No, I don't know. All of a sudden, we find out that you are opening up a team here in L.A. at our office through a company-wide e-blast. Oh, We're wait. friends. Okay, Why hasn't he ever, ever... I did. No. We were a catch. No. You were sitting next to me. I said, I'm going to start doing business here. There was no... OK, Heather, Heather. It's just bizarre. Yeah, it is very bizarre. Because Your reaction just, is it's... bizarre. He's like, I didn't do anything wrong. Are you guys afraid of competition? I lost all respect for him in that moment. I was completely shocked and caught off guard. I wouldn't forget to tell you if we were opening an office in New York and moving to New York if it's we talked straight to up you shady. all the time. The fact that he approached you like that and didn't come to me, I'm gonna put him in his place. Frederick's a smart guy. He clearly did not want anyone to know that he wanted to move into the LA territory. And that's that. You want to come to L.A.? Great. How about maybe I should call him? Josh, guess what? I'm thinking of coming to L.A. I want to open up the office. We love you guys. Can you show me some houses? Yes, you guys are friends of mine, and I've enjoyed our time, but I can't call every single friend and, like, update everybody on what I'm doing. Just be real, bro. I was hurt that he didn't call me and tell me, but I got pissed because then I heard he was telling people that I was intimidated that he was coming out here. And that's bullshit. The way that you approach this was shit, and you know it's shit. And that's why you're backing up and going around town saying Josh is, is intimidated. He doesn't want me here because I'm gonna sell a lot of business. Like, yes, it's, it looked to me that you felt territorial or threatened or I couldn't figure it out why because I'm not I'm not that kind of person I'm not like a manipulative scheming it's, it's, I don't even think of those terms oh, okay you, uh, you didn't make it to the top being things. that stupid no I'm okay working hard okay okay I'm glad you brought that up mm -hmm. I get an email Eklund Gomes sells 700 million in LA no you haven't I mean yeah you've closed seven deals here in LA through me if, if that's if this is the game you want to play yeah give me one year Give me one. Frederick, 
fucking year. You don't exist here. I make so much more money than you do. If that's what it's about, I make a lot more fucking money than you. I have a much bigger team, and it's only a, <laughs> it's only far. Bro, until... you think this is about money? That's how shallow you are, bro. Nasty. And you know what? By the way, I I protected you through so many. Sit down. I always you were my friend.